beauties it's me tony and today's video is another unboxing today i'm going to be unboxing um a purchase that i made during the neiman Marcus sale um if you haven't seen my video about the sale at neiman Marcus, i will link that in the cards um also just to let you know the sale has gotten even better they're taking a uh, 25 percent off um, they are also doing that online as well. However, so the shoes that I bought online, they didn't have 25% off, but in the store, they did have those shoes for 25% off. So just letting you guys know, you get a better deal if you just, if you have a Neiman Marcus near you and you just go in and you check that out. So if you are new to my channel, my channel focuses on a little bit of travel. I do lifestyle, some fashion content, like my shoes and luxury unboxings, that sort of thing. And I also do um, fitness as well. So if you haven't checked out any of those and you are kind of interested in any of those things, then make sure you check those out. Um, I wanna thank all of my new subscribers for just joining the group, the family, whatever we wanna call ourselves. I really do appreciate you guys. Those of you who have been coming back and watching my videos, but haven't subscribed yet, Think about it, consider it. If you like what you see, you know, you must like a little bit of something if you're coming back. So anyways, I do appreciate you guys just for watching my videos, okay? So I wanna thank you guys for watching my videos, subscribing those who have subscribed and just taking the time out to see what I'm gonna be talking about today. So um, one of my latest videos, I unboxed this um, bandeau right here that I got from Louis Vuitton, I got this on my trip to San Juan, Puerto Rico. So when I went to Puerto Rico, I just got back a couple of days ago. I picked this up. Like I said in that video, um, when I go traveling for vacations and that sort of thing, I'm just trying to find like one special piece instead of buying like a ton of things and I don't use them. So I wanna get something more practical. I used to buy like mugs and that sort of thing when I go to different places or different countries that I visited and what happens is I don't I don't drink coffee, so I don't use the mugs. They're just on display. So I want something that I can use, even though it's just twelve dollars on a mug, versus like the two hundred dollar headband. You know, um, I definitely do get more use out of this than I do my mugs. So I'll link the unboxing of this headband in the cards as well. So on to my Neiman Marcus unboxing. So um, I have been on this Sophia Webster kick. So. I got another Sophia Webster uh, item to unbox. This I actually seen in the store the last time when I did the Neiman Marcus, like shop around. I seen these in the store. However, I tried them on. They were like, I liked how they fit in everything, but I was like, um, Saks has them as well. And Saks kept sending me a 20% off like spin item at their store and Sophia Webster's items actually qualify. So it was actually cheaper for me to get it at sex, but it wasn't like that instant gratification. So I didn't bite and get it off sex because I wanted to get it right away, like at Neiman. So I just waited around. And then, so this week, actually today, I went back to uh, Neiman Marcus in between. My son plays basketball and that sort of thing. So uh, when he has tournaments, I like to go shopping in between games. And so I went to go shop. Uh, I like to like window shop because I wasn't really planning on buying anything, but I like to just, you know, go see what's out there just in case there's something that might tickle my fancy, I guess, just because my birthday's coming up. So I'm just getting things to say happy birthday to myself, I guess. So anyways, um, I had already seen these shoes, so I decided to just check out Nima Marcus again. And that was actually my last stop before I needed to get back to the car and go to this game. So um, I went in there and I seen the shoe. I already knew I tried it on and I seen it was extra 25% off. So I'm like, let me grab the shoe. Okay, so I grabbed the shoes. So here's the box, let's unbox it. So again, there's Sophia Webster. Um, these are the Inez Esperil Day slide. They're a multi-metallic. And what really drew me to this shoe is that it has a gold, it's gold silver and rose gold so it's really cute and they retail for $2.95 however I didn't spend $2.95 on these so let me show you the shoe we unbox it we got the Sophia Webster dust bag I think it only comes with one dust bag I think I remember that from my last unboxing of the Sophia Webster shoes that I took back these though I'm definitely keeping 
and here we go they're so cute they have this in another colorway too online and they're like a pink um however they're not on sale so here we go here's the shoe you can see how much they were and it was 25 percent off of this price so and you've probably seen these in my um nordstrom rack not nordstrom rack you probably seen these in my neiman marcus um come shop with me sale kind of thing so here's both of the shoes together really cute metallic and i think how i want to style this when i wear them i want to wear them with a um like white button down shirt dress type of thing i think it's really cute if you haven't seen them the bottom these i got these in a size 40 which the other Sophia Webster shoes, the reason why I took them back was because the size 40 didn't fit me. But these, my foot fits pretty well in it. And when I was at the store the first time I tried them on, um, they were telling me that, you know, you want to get them kind of tight because they will eventually loosen up and you don't want them to be too too wide and your foot to be sliding in, in and out of them. But they're very cute. I will insert a video of me wearing these shoes. They're very, very, very cute. Like... If you look at them really close, though, they look like aluminum foil or something like that. That's what they kind of remind me of, but it's a, it's a raffia type. And then the bottom has a little design going around it. Really cute shoes. I really like the opening on the side. just gives it a little bit more. And I have a lot of slide shoes, but what attracted me to these shoes, and I... And I've been picking up a lot of shoes. Um, I'm really stopping buying sandals and going to move into buying boots. But what really attracted me to these shoes is that the soles were a lot higher than a lot of my other slide shoes. The soles are a lot thicker, so it doesn't have me just walking flat on the ground. They're pretty comfortable on the inside. I know they will be even more comfortable once I start wearing them out even more. Um, there is another colorway, and I'll insert a picture clip of those so you can see them as well. But yeah, what I would recommend though, if you see things online that you like and they don't have the extra 25% off and you have a Neiman Marcus that's close to you or um, you don't mind calling around, like call the store and see if they have that shoe in stock and then ask for them to send it to you because then you can pay and still get that 25% off. I'm pretty sure of it. So that's what I would do. Uh, when I went around, a lot of the shoes that you've seen in my other video, they still had a lot of those, but they added more stuff too. I just didn't like anything that was added that like caught my attention to be like, okay, yeah, let me spend the money on these. Um, they still had Louis Vuittons, like, and they had a pair I really liked. They just weren't in my size, and I don't know if I, if I would have pulled them and asked them could they have looked in another store. I didn't even think to do that. So, um, but that's okay. I'm happy with what I have um purchased already anyways the soles are like a rubber sole again this shoe is the Inez Esperaldi slide the multi metallic very pretty shoes like the perfect summer shoe and so I'll probably take these on my next vacation in a couple of weeks um when I go to Mexico so I'll probably take these with me um but yeah really cute shoes really really cute shoes so definitely would say you guys if you haven't checked out the sales at Neiman Marcus please go check out like you don't know what your uh city might have you know they might have some really good things um that you don't see online like some of the stuff that I see in store um like the Louis Vuitton I see those in my store but they're not on the site so like make sure you go to a store if you can and see if they have the shoe a shoe that you would like um because they have boots too so if you're not like if you're done with summer and you want to shop for next season they have Stuart Wiseman boots they have all kind of different boots um they even had some Prada shoes on sale I really want these Prada boots I'm going to insert these I really want these I am looking for them on sale I actually tried on a pair today in Saks and um I wasn't ready to bite the bullet on them. I'm not ready to pay full price for them because I know that I can get them a lot less than that. And I'm also trying to sell a couple of shoes before I just bite the bullet and get them shoes. But I know that I'm trying to get them before before fall hits. Like I wanna get these shoes before fall hits because once 
once fall that season comes a lot of these shoes they go out of stock and you and it's hard to find especially in store so um but i did want to try on for size because i'm typically a 40 in prada shoes but i actually fit the 39 just fine so i know now if i don't see it in the 40 that i can do a 39 so that sort of thing i'm just waiting to make the purchase but i think those are the boots that i want to get um, because I think I can wear them a couple of seasons or longer than that. I just want to make sure that I love the shoe because even when stuff goes out of season, I'm still going to wear my shoes. I'm still going to wear the stuff that I like. So I, I want to make sure that um, I make a wise purchase because those boots are pretty expensive. So I want to sell some of the shoes that I have not been wearing so that it kind of offset the cost a little bit. But, so that's one way, like if you're buying luxury stuff, um, try to make sure like if you don't want to go into debt or feeling like you're trying to keep up with somebody get rid of the stuff that you know you're not using and I have tons of stuff that I know I'm not wearing anymore that I've outgrown and that are in pretty good condition some stuff like some shoes I have that I haven't even worn like heels and that sort of thing so if I can get rid of that sell it for 20 some dollars or like 40 50 bucks depending on what I have you know um, some shoes even more like some of my designer shoes I'm gonna get rid of because of the fact that how they fit and hurt my foot and I've been trying to give them a chance and you know the chances I the chances are gone now no more chances but um yeah those are ways to save you know to feel like you're saving or to feel like you're you're actually being intentional about what you're buying and you're not wasting your money and that sort of thing. Just clearing out, doing a closet clean out, selling that stuff on Macari or Poshmark or whatever and making some a little bit of something just to offset your cost a little bit. Like, I, I love that. I love that. Um, I will probably be doing another unboxing because I did make an impulse buy this morning. <laughs> So I'll probably be doing that one when that one comes in a couple of days and that'll be fun because I don't know if these shoes will actually fit or not and I need to stop buying shoes but it is what it is like I said I am going to be getting rid of stuff because I'm not trying to hoard I'm not trying to be wasteful with my money and that sort of thing but that's that um try Neiman Marcus if you haven't checked out their sale check it out Saks also has a sale Saks sale be here and there sometimes I really like sack sales though for the most part online they usually hit a lot better than in stores but in stores you can find a lot of gems especially if you know a sales associate that looks out for you or they remember your face so they're like oh girl you'll like this or oh boy you'll like this that sort of thing so just check it out okay check it out um and that's really all i have you guys i want to thank you guys for just watching my video, hear me ramble about stuff. I really, really like to bring you content about <laughs> the shoes and the things that I'm buying and when I'm actually saving money because that's how I like to shop in general. I like to save money. I'm not, I don't want to spend a lot of money on luxury stuff, but I want to feel luxurious. And if you're like that, consider joining the channel so you can feel luxurious and get these deals too. I will start to post some of that stuff on my Instagram as well. So check out my Instagram. All that information will be linked in the description box below if you're interested and in just following me over there. I'll post pictures, I'll post workouts, that sort of thing. Do more things daily than, you know, me on YouTube. So that sort of thing. But I wanna thank you guys for watching my videos yo don't forget to like to comment subscribe and i want to thank you guys again because you could have been anywhere else but you decided to be here and i appreciate that i hope you guys have a good night good morning good evening whenever you're choosing to watch this video and i'll see you guys on the next one bye